So, China is making some crazy progress in AI department. And the matter of fact is that they are all doing this with all the restrictions and bans on them. On one side, there is Huawei, which is still manufacturing AI chipsets even though the US has banned it from working with companies like Nvidia and TSMC. And on the other side, we have DeepSeek R1 AI platform, which is still offering super powerful AI services at insanely low prices. So much so that it's already outpacing big players like OpenAI and Google's Gemini. But why is DeepSea growing so fast? Well, the biggest reason is the pricing and accessibility. Most AI platforms limit their services, even in paid versions, meaning you have to pay for more extra usage. But DeepSea R1 based apps are completely free and unlimited at the same time. To put this into perspective, ChatGPT's GPT-4 Turbo cost $15 per million input tokens. But DeepSeek, well just $0.55 for the same amount of data. That's not just cheaper, it's a game changer thing. And there's Huawei, which is working on some next level AI hardware. They recently built the Huawei SN910C AI chip which already delivers 60% of the NVIDIA's H100 performance. But they are not stopping there. Huawei is now developing the SN920C chipset, which is expected to match or even surpass NVIDIA's best AI chips. That means China will no longer need to rely on NVIDIA or any other US company for the AI hardware. So this proves one thing. Huawei and DeepSeek are leading China toward complete AI independence. Instead of depending on the foreign technology, China is now developing its own AI ecosystem, which could soon dominate the global AI industry. So at this pace, China might even beat US in AI technology very soon. What do you guys think about it? Will Huawei and DeepSeek reshape the future of AI? Let me know in the comments down below. And as always, I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.